Hello everybody, this is Mithril Zenith. Welcome back to Age of Kings for the DS. We are on the Minamoto Yoshitsune campaign, Mission 3, the Battle of Ichinotani. Yoshitsune must find a way to capture the Tiber Mountain stronghold of Ichinotani. Their defeats at the hand of Minamoto Yoshitsune force the Taira to hold up in their mighty castle of Ichinotani, nestled in the mountains. Their backs against the wall, they would fight fiercely and bitterly, like cornered animals. Yoshitsune prepared for the assault. He had known nothing but victory thus far, but he was wise enough to know that the past was no assurance of the future. A direct attack, while simple, would be the most risky. Perhaps there was another way. Master, to the north lies the Tyra stronghold of Ichinotani. The Tyra are well warned of our approach. The road and castle will be heavily defended. Let us not allow haste to cloud our judgment. And, Master, there are tales of an old hermit who dwells in these powers. Legends say he has holy power, and no love of the Tyra. Bah, rumors only, my master. Pay them no heed, and do not let it distract you from our objective. Speaking of which, what are our objectives? Destroy Ichinotani Castle. Defeat all Tyra units. Find the old hermit monk, and keep all siege units intact. So we want... <laughs> So the game is telling us to be tricky, or go around, or don't be direct. Uh, but if we want the bonuses, uh, we need to kill everyone. And we need to keep all our siege units intact, which are the rams and the onagers. Okay, what do we have? We have a lot of samurai, it looks, lo looks like. Um, some knights and horse archers. It's like two knights, two horse archers, uh, a couple scouts. I don't know why two of our units are facing down when the rest are facing up, but that's just life. Uh, what's the map overall look like? Oh, looks like we have some distance to cover. Let's get on with it. Scouts have the best vision range, so I'll move those first, and we're dead. Cool. Light cavalry, archers, crossbowmen, all fantastic things. Um, is there a better way to do this that I can get more units? Okay, I want to move up so I'm not like, too far behind. So you look in the mountains over here. Okay, nothing over there. You can't really move that far. It's only adjacent units this gives bonuses to, so that's limited. Oh, I hate that I put that scout cavalry there. That's really unfortunate. Yeah. Is this a reset? I don't think it is right away, but... Definitely not ideal. Okay, Minamoto's guard, that should help us to take down the pikemen on the road. Okay, a better fight than otherwise. That's <coughs> our crosswomen so they can do some work next turn, possibly. Okay, if we try to attack their crossbowmen, we are dead. I thought they were just archers. Oh, the archers in the back. Okay, that makes more sense. Well, we can take down the pikemen. Or we can deal some damage to their... Uh... Light cavalry. I think taking down the pikemen is important, because... That way our cavalry can move forward. Oh, and we get the mountain. Nice. Which means we can attack their light cavalry. How is everyone doing today? I hope you're all doing well. I'm just going to be moving my samurai forward. Forget how the game expects you to play this map. I don't think this is the way. <laughs> I'm 
but this is what I got. I love that samurai have nine movement uh, and no cavalry weakness. That is nice. I mean, in this game, cavalry don't have like restricted movement like they do in something like Fire Emblem. Uh, restricted movement in terms of like terrain doesn't cost more for cavalry to move on than it does for other units. I think cavalry still can't move in swamps, just like siege can't move in swamps or or unroaded mountains. But there's not like a numerically it takes longer to travel through forest or something like there is for Fire Emblem. Okay, well, their crossbowmen, uh, that scout cavalry is dead. No, it was fun while it lasted, and they're killing my horse art. Why do they attack the ones that are on the mountains? Oh, because their light cavalry can deal damage now. Hmm. Not an ideal start. I think I want to do this and then buff my crossbow. Um, I'm only buffing one of my... Yeah, let me think about this for a second. Because these buffs are really powerful tools. But I don't want to waste them, you know? Which I do this and attack into the mountain. And then I can Minamoto's guard buff here. <coughs> Take down their crosswoman through the mountain. My knights able to take on theirs, maybe? Uh, I still don't like the idea of fighting knights on an open field, so let's... Wait, those are knights. Um, for some reason I thought they were horse archers. I only had one horse archer in that. Because the second one died. Let's use knights to take those down. Let's use my buff samurai to attack these knights. Oh, that's a lot of archers. That's a lot of archers they got. Hmm. This seems problematic. Let's take down their knights. Finish off their light cavalry. Scout this area. Scouts have discovered a winding path around the main road. It may lead to our fortune or our, our fortune or our demise. Well, we have limited forces in terms of skirmishers. We only have one. We only have one horse archer now. One pikeman. And one onager, one battering ram. Which is unfortunate, so we will be very careful with them. There's no reason for the battering ram to be in the front at all anyway. Because its purpose is to soak shots. No, not soak shots. Its purpose is to take down the castle at the very end of this gauntlet. Okay, so the upper road is leading to my death. It's great news, great to hear. Okay. For some reason their archers attacked in melee range. I love the AI. They're brilliant. They truly are aware of what they're doing. Oh! Scouts with planes charge. One shot. Uh... Sorry. Knights with planes charge. One shot. Let me start those sentences over. Knights with planes charge. One shot scouts if both are at full HP. Very good information to have. Okay, skirmishers. Still just as annoying as always. Um, if I move there, then I get a decent... 
decent buff on all my units. Yeah, clever use of your hero unit's powers is what will lead to victory or defeat. Well, what separates victory from defeat, rather. Assuming one can even close the distance. Okay, what can I attack from here? Oh, those samurai do not take a lot of damage from me. Let's do something like that, then. Samurai are powerful, but they're no match for other samurai. that and then oh, I guess I could have moved those skirmishers first oh well uh, such is life move and everyone forward move and everyone forward in the mountain is the better place to put you uh, hill road that's pretty solid One night left. Hmm, I'm not really a fan of any of these positions, so I'm just gonna move like. I'm just gonna stay there. Okay. Yeah, this is a strategic battle. This is one of those ones where it's like, yeah, don't bother building, building up a town. Let's just go straight for it and you live with your punishment. Also, Looks like that winding side road did lead to our demise, because samurai on the road. <laughs> okay, archers, samurai. Now they don't have any easy wins, though. Crossbow crossbowman? Where? What mountain are you hiding crossbowmen in? Ah, I guess my crossbowmen are going to have to take down your samurai. Shamurai. Guess those can actually attack, that's good. I'm going to keep my horse archers in a safe-ish distance. Away from the enemy. Uh, is it time to start healing? It might be. something like this, then I can Inspiring General to heal my units. That'll help a little bit. <clears throat> Finish off their Samurai. Attack from the mountains over here. There's the Crossbowman. Attack! Crosswomen and mountains are exceedingly dangerous and need to be taken out as soon as possible. Uh, am I spreading myself too thin? Probably. Are these samurai gonna just run me over? Probably. Not a risk I'm willing to take. Uh, they forced my hand, then I don't really have another option. Get a planes charge. Uh, it deals more damage when I take significant damage, too. I'll just hole up in the forest. And that's all my units for the turn. The Tyra, day four. Yeah, I'm not feeling very good about this. I think this is not looking good. I've played this poorly. Yeah. 
A skirmish in the mountains has led to our demise. That said, I have Minamoto Yoshitsune on my team. I'm gonna be fine. I think the time has come for us to use him to attack. Because look at that power. Hey, the samurai is dead, so let's finish off their crossbows. Uh, you can finish off their samurai. Oh, I could attack their knights. Whoops. Okay, one HP, one HP, what the heck. I see how it is. You have a villager kill a samurai that, at that rate. First strike from the mountains. First strike from the mountains. Finish you off with pikemen? Yes, okay. here. Okay. Not too many enemies left. <clears throat> I think the back and forth on this mission is really interesting. Okay, archers versus battering rams. Losing any of these siege units will make it all the more difficult to bring down the castle. I am well aware. I'm just very glad that they are easily distracted by them. Oh, swamp. I hate moving through swamp. But I think that's where the hermit is? The hermit in the mountains? I think he's in the swamp. I don't fully remember. Okay, so I can either buff these two. Or I could attack. I think attack this time is the better option. So I'm just going to move forward like that. And attack the samurai. Mountains into mountains. Nobody's going to die here. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess I did fight through. Good. 16%. Should be able to do that much damage with pikemen, even if they are in mountains. I'm gonna wait in the back here and move up the onagers for support. Seems like a good day, good move. Six turn, day six, okay. Oh, there goes the pikemen. Oh, there go my samurai. They have skirmishers in the swamps, what? Skirmishers shouldn't even be able to throw things through the swamps. Oh, because they're not in the swamps, they're at the end of the swamp. Okay, that's unfortunate. Okay, our units, our units. Attack from here. Managers do good damage still, that's nice. Horse archers can probably attack their knights. Scouts have discovered another path. Attack. Oh, nobody can get there to attack. So frustrating. Okay. I was going to try to uh, there's no time limit so why push forward <coughs> I was gonna say I was going to try to... Uh, heal up some of my units, but it looks like they're not going to give me that option. 
If we can kill off those skirmishers, that'd be great. Okay, so we have one, two, three. If we could take the spot where that knight is. Oh, of course we can't even move there anyway. Inspiring general. Damage we can against their skirmishers. Oh, okay, just move like that. Yeah, I don't really want to move too much forward. Okay, so there's the castle. Looks like they have scorpions set up. We can move here and attack their castle directly. Uh, one skirmisher is going to kill two samurai. Is that what's going to happen? That's very unfortunate. Okay. At least I'm not being ranked on efficiency. That would not end well. Heal up my samurai and move forward. Uh, more archers, okay. Fine. Be that way. Okay, if I let those knights close, that's gonna actually be really bad for me. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to attack them. And position up defensively. So if they attack me, they die in turn. Can I just have you retreat over here? Maybe the monk is over here. It seems the tales were true after all, Master. This old hermit is indeed a powerful monk. He says he is annoyed at the Tyra and finds your quest to be an honorable one. Perhaps his smooth voice will convince some of the Tyra to side with us. Or I can just heal, because it's an elite monk, so he heals at like plus 30 or something. Maybe it's like 50. I don't know. Elite monks heal for an absolute ton of HP. In limited unit situations like this, elite monks are incredibly valuable. Oh, uh, well, that's not great for my onagers. Please tell me that's not on a... It is on a hill. So they can attack my skirmishers there. Oof. Attack like that. Attack like that. I'm stuck over here. No. Okay. Well, we're gonna keep healing because that's where we're at right now. Uh, my high veterancy should be able to make a difference. I think it's like 10% per flag. 10% bonus damage per flag, that's actually a pretty strong amount. Because Samurai get veterancy at such a much higher rate than anyone else. Let you finish you off. This should do some damage to you. And then it's just... Okay, let's do that. Okay, so... 51 to 90, oof. 39 healing. Nice. Okay, so we are in position to finish them off because it should just be the archer, the samurai, and the knights, and the scorpions. Okay. 
Oh shoot, uh, there are knights over there. Also, I did not mean to stand still. That's on me. Tyra is summoning all their defenses to the castle. It must fall quickly. Yeah. You're telling me something I don't know. I think actually merging my units is going to be a better use of them. At that point. Okay, and we're just going to make sure we finish off their knights and archers. Staying on hills, so they can't easily defeat me. Oh. Well then. I guess I'm gonna... It has no purpose to use Inspiring Channel. He wasn't hurt. I don't think scorpions have minimum range, but if he does attack at melee, I will counter. Assuming I'm not dead. And that's why I merged up my units. Because I would be dead if not for that. Okay, so doing whatever I did prompt all the enemy to retreat. Good. I can charge them from behind and die horribly. Let's not do that. Heal up my samurai. Destroy their scorpions. I, I said destroy their scorpions, not leave them at one health. Ugh, so annoying. If I left them alive, they would heal up, and that would be very unfortunate for us all. Okay. And now... I should be in position to take them out. It's a poor use of my units, but I am going to attack their knights. Just because it'll end things a little bit faster. There go those skirmishers. Let's take down these crossbows. Heal up a little bit. Make fighting the crossbows a little bit easier. Wait, why am I attacking a melee first? I have crossbows! I to remember I have crossbows. They're good. They're effective units. And the Tyra are completely defenseless. They're... The Tyra are scattered. Their castle is completely defenseless. I can read. I have that ability, oftentimes. And that's the end of the mission, just as soon as I have the day pass back to me. That was fun. A little bit stressful, but not too bad. And let's watch us roll through. This land is purged of the Tyra stench, Master. Come, let us depart the wasteland to Yashima. Three stars. Yep, we overcame the battle. Three star ranking. Fourteen days. The capture of Ichinotani was the stuff of legend. Yoshitsune, with a bare minimum of men, had taken the fortress in a precise blend of strategy and boldness, only possessed by truly gifted generals. Despite the victory, though, the Taira Emperor had escaped. He fled west to the Taira home of Yashima, a village on the north coast of Shikoku. The clan war was not over. Well, what is over is Mission 3. 
Thank you so much for watching, and join us next time, where we will invade Yashima and defeat the Tyra clan for good. Thank you so much. If you enjoyed, leave a like, sub to the channel, and I hope to see you next time. This is Mythos Zenith, signing out.